Hey folks, this is IOE throwing back with some more World of Tanks. As you can see, this is Alex the Assassin, and he's in his T29. This is a tier 8 game on Pilsen, and this is a pretty... This is a beautiful tank. Um, as far as heavies go, I think this is the first one I really truly enjoyed. And if you get, get this thing hauled down and you wiggle it a little bit, then it is nigh on indestructible. Yes! You can shoot in the turret, in the cheeks of the turret. But than that, in this tiny little spot right there, and of course the cupola, you're not going to get into this thing from the front. And so, if you can get this thing hauled down, like, you know, on a rubbish pile, then it becomes, well, difficult. To the point where somebody might as well just go around you rather than try and go through you. Because it will just be easier. Um... Ooh, unfortunately not hitting the uh, the T20 he was aiming at. This thing also has the ability to side scrape, which is what we're doing right now. Um, and all just all around, this is a great tank. If you are new to the game or whatnot, this is the tank you want. Or new to heavy tanks. You want to learn some heavy tanks? Grab this thing. And um, all the way up the line, this is actually not bad. The only problem is the M103 is unfortunately trash. But other than that, it's a great one. Um, I was going to say something about something else, and I've gotten distracted, and now I've forgotten. Oh, right. Um, speaking of, I don't know what I was speaking of, but I'm going to try and segue this, so we're just going to go with stuff. Um, I know, I'm epic at segues, right? I'm great at tangents. You guys all know this, I, I should hope. Um, so... We're just going to jump on a tangent and go with, um, this is going up on Friday at sa Saturday morning, and Sunday morning I will be doing a live stream over on Twitch, uh, raising money for veterans. Um, we're going to do three hours on Saturday morning starting at 8 a.m. Eastern, and four hours on Sunday morning starting at, again, 8 a.m. Eastern, and we're going to raise as much money as we can. We're, uh, Great Taz and I are going to be playing Civilization 5. It's a game we both really enjoy that isn't World Tanks as much as we would like. You know, we could play World Tanks together. Um, we want to play some Civ 5. And, um, and so we're going to. We're going to stream it. Whoever wins, that's whose charity gets the, uh, the money. Uh, all the money from the stream will go to the charity. Whoever charity wins. Um, or whoever wins is charity, right? So, um, so for me, as far as I'm concerned, that means any subscriptions I get to Twitch, bits, donations, whatever, is all going to go straight to uh, whatever charity, or whichever team's charity wins, right? You know what I mean. Um, and so, Great Taz is su supporting the Wounded Warriors pause right here before the real real action starts. Uh, Taz is supporting the Wounded Warriors Project um, and I am supporting True Patriot Love, which is a Canadian version of a similar um, thing. It's mostly just veterans, but it's, uh, it's one of the, the better Canadian veterans charities. And so yeah, that is that. Um, come out tomorrow, even if you just watch um, for, you know, 10, 20 minutes, you want to drop a $2, $5 donation, that'd be great. If you can't donate, donate some of your time. Come out, watch. You know? I'm sure you can encourage us, or you can try and pit us against each other. Um, the only thing I ask is please, no spoilers. Okay, please? Not that I'm pretty sure it, it's hard to spoil Civ 5, really. But anyways, um, yeah, and with that, on with the game. I hopefully will see all you guys there, and uh, spread the word around, and let's let's make some money. Ooh, and how did you miss that? I uh, I don't I don't know how he missed, but apparently he missed. So he scopes all all the way in, and then doesn't kill the artillery. Not though. I don't know what this tiger is doing because apparently. He's had a couple of decent shots at us, and he still hasn't managed to do anything with them. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. 
Oh, and Tiger gets one more shot and again misses badly. Reloading before the track goes back on for the AMX down there, unfortunately. A can't see him, and B, we couldn't get a clean shot. That's a clean shot, though. We'll take that. And Tiger again pops out, and again is going to be utterly useless. <laughs> We're going to re-go before this guy gets a shot off. Oh, no, actually, he did get a shot. And then we shot the gun mantle on the AMX. Wow, okay then. <laughs> All this time. <laughs> Alex is over here yelling for help. And his team's just like, do 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 do. Huh, you might need some help. Aw, oh, that was a great shot you could have had on the, the drive wheel, but um, not not to happen apparently. Centurion is just saying it wants a piece of this action too. And finally, no, actually he's not held down. Tiger 1 dies. Well, that's helpful. Centurion is going to have an issue here in a second. Because I'm fairly certain the WZ can see him too. As our team starts to win this thing, we're going to go ahead and push um, the enemies back into a corner. We're going to go ahead and leave by the, the little side alley here and see if we can't scoot around on, a, on their flank. Where they're not looking, hopefully. Um, yes, who's gonna get... Oh, look at that shot. Oh, yeah, we'll take that every day. Spotted now, but uh, it's a bit late for that, right? Oni taking a shot, thankfully, doesn't kill our target. So we can get up and use this little bit of cover. So he's only gonna be shooting at parts he can't pen, and he HGs us. Oh, that's understandable. I mean, what else was he going to do? Centurion over there. Oh, yeah, just back up. Oh, beautiful job. Thank you, Centurion. We needed just that tiny little part of your tank to shoot at. And that was that. Ooh, as the Tiger P again hits us with HE. And again, Alex puts a shot through his weak point. This guy can't see anything but our turret and has decided he can't do anything to our turret anyway. He might as well just HG us to death. Unfortunately for him, this is not really a tactic that actually works. Um, we're so sort of fast forward this tiny, tiny bit. Because you all want to see how this ends. Ah, no knee to the side. That, that'll that be how that ends. Um, if the scorpion is still up there, we're never going to get there. Oh, look at that. He's, he's decided he's got his two marks of excellence. And so we're just going to have to... You know what? We're never going to get to the scorpion. And there's no way we can shoot him. So I'm just going to end the replay here. Um, and so don't forget about the charity event. Come out tomorrow morning at some point between... Oh, wait. Did we have a shot on him? We did for a second. At some point between 8 a.m. and 11. Ooh, we hit him. Nice shot. Um, 8 a.m. and 11 tomorrow and then 8 a.m. and 12 on Sunday. Yeah, they're kind of short streams, but it's just... Life is a thing, right? And we both have kids, and apparently they take priority somehow. Over, you know, charity. Right? Okay, so I'll see you guys in a second. He did, in fact, get his second mark of excellence. He also got an ace tanker, hand of God, a shell poof, duelist, fire for effect, one bond, and a high caliber award. One bond, considering the fact that he's in a tier 7 tank. In a tier 8 game, this is not bad, um, and he did really, really well. 1,300 base experience. Um, I'm, before I get any, like, that was an amazing game and all that stuff, because I get that every once in a while. How many times have you gotten 1,300 experience in a, in a uh, Tier 7? And if you have, can I see those games? Because it, it's hard to get and rare and well done. No phone. Bad phone. I saw my phone light up as it decided to start ringing on me. We're not doing that in the middle of a recording, though. So, um, 17 shots fired. Yeah, all this was well done. That is the most impressive part. Uh, that is, of course, the fact that he was blocking those shots from that tiger. But just the fact that he was angling his armor correctly, he was making sure that, you know, he wasn't a giant target. 
and he just he played this really well. And whether he's running a premium or a standard account, either way, he made money and a decent amount of experience. So thank you, Alex, for sending this in, and uh, I enjoyed that game. I can't wait to see what I can pull out of the archives for tomorrow and uh, see if I can wow you guys with that. Um, but for now, come tomorrow to the charity event. And if you can donate something, that'd be great. If you can't, don't worry about it, okay? Just come in and show your support. It'd be great. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. This is IOE Throughout.